Hello, okay, here we are. It's another sunny one. Uh, back with another body weight strength and conditioning workout for you to uh, follow. No equipment is needed, no gym, no excuses. Uh, 10 minutes, 40 seconds work, followed by 20 seconds recovery. Um, beginners, one round, everyone else, two to three rounds, two to three minutes rest in between each round. If you're following online, uh, just follow your bespoke online plan. Okay, let's do it. The first exercise is gonna be walkouts. Go! Vertical standing position. Touch the toes, walk out into your push-up plank position. Walk the hands back to toes, bend the knees. Back to the standing position, good posture, and repeat. Body weight, you dictate that tempo so you can pick the pace up a little bit. But don't sacrifice form for speed. Nice horizontal line, engage your core. If you're following online, you will have your um, alignment video tutorial. Well done, so that's the first one complete. 20 seconds recovery, moving on to our second exercise, which is gonna be a push-up. However, we are gonna do uh, three standard push-ups, and then we're gonna put our knees to the floor and do three close hand push-ups. And we're just gonna alternate between the two for the full 40 seconds. Go. So standard push-up, three, one, two, three. Knees down, hands closer together, isolates the triceps, one, Two, three, back up, and down. If you're struggling with the push-up, not quite there yet, three, close hand, and then just open up and carry on on the knees. You're still going to feel that burn, that overload. The rest of us back up. Oh, there you go. Starting to feel the burn. Triceps, shoulders, chest. Again, don't forget to uh, keep that core nice and engaged. Nice alignment throughout. Planks, push-ups. Okay, our next one is a single leg hip or glute bridge, raise, whatever you want to call it. Go. So we've been working on the two-footed. I'm going to put left foot across right knee. I'm going to lift and squeeze. You may feel hip. A little bit of peripheral almost to the glute, now under control, up and down, try to keep this uh, square, if you're tight that knee's going to kick right up to the sky, lift and squeeze, swap sides, we're looking for about 20 seconds each side, again body weight, you can find out where your imbalances are, no escape in that connected yes. chain. I'm going to do a couple more. And done. So now we're going to move back to that uh, push-up plank. So again, if you're following online, you're probably uh, ready to progress to the next one. But if you're new here, just go. Standard push-up plank. Open the legs up, makes a little bit more body assistance. Closer together makes it a lot harder. Not letting that lower back sag. Again, check out your uh, alignment tutorials. So for the rest of us, we're going to come from this push-up plank. Bend at the knees, keeping them off the floor. Your butt, which is your glutes, back to your heels. One and two. One and two. We call it a cannonball because you're in this cannonball. Shoot out the cannon into your push-up plank. So there you go, you've got the isometric push-up plank option. That's hard enough, that's challenging enough, but if you're ready to progress into your cannonball. Okay, our next one is, we're gonna throw a little bit of resistance, now we're gonna throw in some conditioning, strength and conditioning circuit. Go. Lateral movement, lateral shuffle, one, two, reach out. One, two, three, keep that chin up. Avoid rounding your shoulders, protect that lower back. Pick that pace up, really reach out, feel the obliques, the love handle area, lateral movement, 
lots of sports have this lateral movement racket, ball sports. Nearly there. Rest. Good work, well done. So exercise six, we're gonna move on to a uh, sumo squat. So if you've been following, you'll have your standard bilateral squat, sumo squat, we're gonna open up, a little bit wider than hip width, turn the toes out, sit back into your squat, Go. sumo, one, two, sit back, standard squat, same technique, weight onto the heel, sit back, push your chest out, chin up, the rest of us, jump sumo squat. So, one, slide in, two, balls to the feet, not slamming, one, two, you can step out, jump, step out, jump, a bit more advanced, get up a little bit, well done. Jelly legs, good job. So modified, beginners, newbies, standard sumo squat, the rest of us jump squat. Now we're going to do a rowing exercise, pulling exercise from the push-up plank position. Push down the left, pull up the right, rowing exercise and alternate. Again, contract absolutely abs and glutes nice and uh, tight, right, engaged, aligned, not letting the back sag, no pressure on that lower back, if you need to rest, knees down, back up, you're better off uh, taking that breather and executing the exercise correctly as opposed to rushing through and hurting yourself. Good job. So, back to uh, a lateral movement. I quite like this one. This is kind of a holistic movement. We have got a lateral lunge with a rotation. <sighs> Type 2 spinal action. Go. So I'm going to lunge to my left. Knee in line with the toe hinge. One. Rotate right. Two. And repeat. One. Two, when I rotate, good standing posture, I rotate from the thoracic vertebrae, your rib cage. <sighs> Opposites, quadrilateral system. One, two, three. <sighs> One, two, three. Straighten the arms out, you'll find more rotation in the back. movement you'll feel that uh, mobility in your adductors and then we've got a nice rotational exercise <sighs> feels good so now I'm going to uh, do exactly the same I'm going to lunge right rotate left <sighs> feet together good standing posture one two three so you're not pushing that knee out twisting that knee <sighs> one two, three, standing posture, one, two, three, nice September's breeze, fresh air in the lungs, controlling the breathing, rest, well done. So that quadrilateral opposites, we walk, we run, punch, everything comes from that quadrilateral system opposites. Okay, so our last exercise of the 10 minute round is a burpee. Yeah, our old favourite. So standard burpee. One, two, three, four. Let's get centre on camera. The rest of us, we can incorporate the jump. Again, ball to the feet. Push up and jump. Nice and consistent, every rep the same, not 
slam in. Keep pushing nearly there. Big finish. One more. Rest. Well done.